My name is Andrea Reimer. I'm a city councillor here in the city of Vancouver, and I'm excited to be joining this national conversation on reimagining the CBC. CBC for me was really a way to hear and learn about what was happening across the country, particularly, um, particularly given the time we grew up with the, the French English battles and and to feel connected to people who we wouldn't otherwise have had a way to get connected to. We've always been challenged as this massive country. So how then do you bridge all of those cultures together before the information age? So now you've got people with information coming in from the United States and from Europe and from Asia. How do we all have a conversation here in Canada about what it means to be Canadian? And then on top of that, what it means to be Canadian in a world that's so connected. What an incredible opportunity through the CBC moving forward to host discussions. Um, I know they already do that, but what about if we could use technology to really plug in and host live discussions, live forums, uh, and move forward together on these critical issues that are facing Canada, whether it's robocalls, which is a very live issue right now, or the future of our cities and our transportation networks and what jobs are going to be there for my daughter and her generation moving into the future. But I have to say, like looking around the world at what's playing well, CBC blows away other national radio services for global podcast downloads, which is something that makes me really proud as a Canadian to sort of sit and contemplate that people all over the world are listening to the Vinyl Cafe because it's some of the best programming that they can get. People all over the world are listening to Quarks and Quarks because these Canadians, this this relatively small country um, is producing this phenomenal science content. It, it, it kind of makes you think, wow, like we're outperforming NPR and BBC and all these other massive countries with these massive investments in their national broadcasting.